So Stravinsky has a mugshot, or what appears to be a mugshot, dated April 15th, 1940. It's black and white, of course, and our friend Igor is really not looking his best. Here's the story on it. People say that Stravinsky was arrested on this date for messing around with the Star Spangled Banner, that tampering with it is against the law, and Stravinsky went on in there and added a scandalous major seventh chord to it. Only part of that is true. Stravinsky was never arrested over his take on the national anthem, but he did get into some trouble over it. That wasn't until later though, years after the picture in question was taken. The picture called Stravinsky's mugshot does, in fact, look a lot like a mugshot, and so the story is quite believable at first. Although Stravinsky does look a little shady, it's not actually a mugshot. It's a picture Stravinsky needed to get taken for a visa application, which is pretty anticlimactic. So let's get to the part where Stravinsky did get in trouble. This was in 1944. Stravinsky was in Boston at the time, and yes, he messed around with the Star Spangled Banner by adding a major seventh chord. And yes, it's against the law to embellish the American national anthem. So Boston police came to Symphony Hall just before a concert where Stravinsky's version of the anthem was supposed to be performed. They issued the composer a warning that night, and they said he would be fined heavily if he would continue to have his version of the anthem performed. So Stravinsky decided to put the Star Spangled Banner aside that night and go on with the rest of the concert. <laughs> 